back out on the Thames after some pike today. It is reasonably early still, which means there's nobody around. It's beautifully calm. The river is about as active as a teenager on a Sunday morning. It really is very docile. And it's all jolly lovely. So we'll have a bash in a couple of weirs, see whether we can find some pike. into our first pike. Not a big in. Well he's in the net. Let's have a look at it. Well, I would have held on to that, uh, I'd had it out of the water longer than I wanted to, um, simply because it came up with somebody else's wire trace, uh, about 10 to 12 inches of pretty cheap, nasty wire, uh, and some very thin mono, uh, and it had got it wrapped around its, uh, head and gill plate, so I couldn't get my, uh, fingers in, in order to chin it out, so that caused a bit of a problem. Um, so in the end, by the time I'd removed that and removed my own lure, uh, it was probably better that it went straight back. But uh, all I can say is, it went back into the water in better shape than I got it out. If you're not experienced, and if you don't know what you're doing, you can really harm and damage a fish. Uh, especially if you're not using the right tackle. Apparently, I don't know whether this is true, but uh, in Germany you have to go through some kind of test or uh, special licensing requirement in order to fish for pike. I think that's a really good idea. I would happily either pay extra money to have a pike license uh, or pay a course fee to do one because fish care should be the primary concern. Anyway, strike one to the replicant. I do love these lures. Out of all the lures that I've got, this one catches the most fish. Having said that though, I think it's time for a change. It's funny, all it takes sometimes is, whoa, hello. No, not into the snags. All it takes is a change of angle. This guy's not done. I've been casting to this place several times over from a different position and had nothing on it. Just a change of angle, same lure, and he's in the net. Lovely stuff. Oh, I was lucky with this fella. Very lightly hooked. Yeah. So lightly hooked that he's come out of the net and then out of the net. Oh well. a little bite on uh, my replicants. Um, I think it was a pike nibbling at the tail and the reason why I think that is because it now looks like that. That beggar. That's not what's supposed to happen. And another. This seems to be sitting in the middle of the channel doing nothing. Come on, wake up. Oh, there we go. It's pretty deep here, runs to about 20 odd feet, so it's got plenty of room to dive into. Come back here. That's better. Come on. In you come.
Well, I don't think I would have caught this fish had one of the others not bitten through my uh, nice little replicant because I don't very often use that lure, but uh, yeah, another little one. Just wish I could find the bigger fish. They've got to be here somewhere, but uh, still, it's better than nothing. Number four. Is this a better fish? Oh, it's a little bit better. It's a little better. It's a lot better, but it's better. There we go. Well, they're getting a bit bigger. Uh, biggest fish of the day so far and the smallest take. It was just a tiny little nudge on the uh, um, 55 gram chubby chaser. Uh, so they're getting steadily bigger. Still not massive though, but uh, a fish is a fish. See what more is out there. It's starting to pick up again. It's been so slow in the last uh, hour or so, but uh, there are still fish around, so we'll carry on. bad fish. Bit of a surprise. Totally wasn't expecting it but not too bad. Uh, it's getting pretty muggy now. Dispense with the jacket and I'm still feeling quite hot so that probably means it's time to call it quits. That last fish I chucked out, didn't even feel the bite properly because I landed the lure straight in weed. It wasn't ideal, but um, yeah, I think that'll be the last one to be honest. No monsters today, but not a bad session. More attitude, maybe. Yeah, a bit more attitude, that's all. Too shabby compared to some of the other ones I've had today. Pretty good. We're getting back. 